Good morning, everyone. My name is Genevieve Noel, and welcome back to my channel. The only heartache that I ever faced was a need of fortune and a dream of fame. I took those empty feelings and turned them into love. It cheats time. It's the eye. In the storm of the universe, I got mine. Where do you think that you will find your home? Those of you who are new here, this channel surrounds my 2020 goals and me reaching them. And this video is part of a subset of videos surrounding my pregnancy. This is my 22 week update. So, for those of you who aren't aware, I've been trying and waiting and getting like this whole ultrasound situation, trying to deal with that. We finally got our ultrasound yesterday, and I have some pictures that I'm going to show you. Look at that, they're so cute. And then this one's a little bit a little bit creepy, but his tongue is sticking out. And then finally a little foot. Which is kicking like crazy. Uh, we did get gender confirmation that it is a boy. Very exciting stuff, so I was like kind of nervous. I was like, I wouldn't be upset if it was a girl, but man, that would change a lot of things. <laughs> so Feeling wise, sitting like in an upright position, super difficult after a while. So what I will do is like lean forward with my stomach between my legs. Um, it makes me a lot more comfortable and I'm just stressing today. Other than that, there haven't really hasn't really been a whole lot of development other than baby boy moving around a lot during the day, evening, afternoon. He's just much more active in general and I can feel him being more active. Sometimes it's really, really painful, like to the point where it feels like his whole body is rolling, which is probably what's happening. But um, so far, as we know, everything looked good on the ultrasound. Obviously, we will have to um, get the results read by a radiologist and then talk to our doctor about it. But we are thinking things are looking pretty good. Um, on my last video that I posted, I got a lot of requests for different types of videos, and I'm going to kind of address that here. In my next video, I'm doing like a vlog type update video, because that was one of those most requested videos was vlogs. Um, other than that, I have a request for like trying on clothes. Unfortunately, because the fact that I don't have a lot of my clothes right now, I can't do that. However, when I get them, I will, when I get them back, I will try and do so. Um, other than that, 22 weeks has been fairly similar to the rest of the second trimester. I'm just a little bit tired, so I'm trying to do the whole trying to do better at the whole exercise and nap rather than just the exercise portion of that request because it is a little bit difficult for me to stay awake. I'm also trying to drink a lot more water now just because, I don't know, I feel like I get really, really thirsty and then I don't want water, so I don't drink water, I drink something else, and then I'm still thirsty, so then I drink something else that's not water, because water just doesn't sound good, and then I just run out of options, because I only do, like, I'm not going to drink 12 glasses of milk or 12 glasses of juice, I just drink half a serving of one of the two, or a serving of one of the two, and then I'll be done, because I'm like, I don't want to overload myself with whatever I'm thirsty for, then I have to drink water, and then that seems to satisfy the thirst. So I'm thinking I'm just thirsty for water, but it doesn't sound good. <laughs> so I need to drink more of that, so I'm working on doing that. I've had almost half a liter today. So I'm working on getting back into that. Another thing that I have been adding, looking to add to my diet, which I'm going to try and kind of put into some blended smoothies once I start making blended smoothies, which will probably be around tomorrow, um, is 
beef gelatin. It's like beef broth gelatin, beef bone gelatin, whatever. Um, or bone gelatin. I don't really know how to explain it exactly. But it is good for like your cartilage and your bones and like your joints. So I'm going to be trying to put that into my smoothies and such. Make things a little bit more, more better in that region. Um, I do have kind of an update on like our whole birthing situation. We have decided to go with a birthing center rather than a home birth as we were previously planning. That way it's just going to be a lot easier for us in a lot of different aspects and I will explain that further like why it'll be easier you'll understand after you see Friday's video but um just in general we ha are, have decided to go with a birthing center which honestly kind of makes me like a little bit more relaxed because then I don't have to have all the stuff and like it possibly not get set up or someone pop the tub or whatever I just a lot of stuff that I didn't want to worry about and now I don't have to but other than that I don't really have a whole lot to say so let's do this One thing that I am trying to figure out is when and how to do my maternity photo shoot because I want to do it when I'm more pregnant and it will be in the winter and there will likely be snow and if there's not snow it will just be very 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 cold um, and I'm going to have my sister do them for me because we are trying to save money on them so if you have any ideas or suggestions please comment below I would find that super duper helpful if you did anything or knew anyone who did anything or if you just have some tips on stuff I would love to hear that otherwise if you like this video don't forget to give it a like and press the bell down below so you can get notifications for when new videos come out. Otherwise, I'll see you on Friday. Love, Genevieve.